Hello, I'm Rick Coppola, a middle school teacher and doctoral candidate from the University of Illinois at Chicago. My classroom served as the research site for our JLR piece entitled, Writing Beyond the Four Corners, Adolescent Girls Writing By, In, From, and Four Bodies in School. Written by Dr. Rebecca Woodard, Andrea Vaughn, and myself, our research draws across multiple conceptualizations of embodiment that position bodies as tools, mediums, and texts to examine the multifaceted nature of embodiment in student writing in schools. We focus on two focal students, Amina, a young Muslim adolescent whose poem, The Face Beneath, details her experience in directly addressing the recent comment of a peer, and Brooklyn, whose poem, Beauty is Pain, interrogates pervasive messages she had received from peers about her body. We are most proud that this article is grounded in a long-term research practice partnership that moved beyond researchers and teacher to include the focal students and their parents in iterative cycles of member checking and writing. While we did not set out with an express interest in exploring embodiment during the course of this 11-week unit, we noticed during our analysis that many students wrote about their bodies and some centrally featured their bodies in performances of their poems. Both vocal participants also counter-narrated against dominant stories about women. Through cycles of analytic coding and memoing, we identified various ways these girls' writing was embodied, infusing ideas from member check interviews in both the analysis and discussion. The embodied nature of Amina and Brooklyn's writing is highlighted through four themes. Number one, embody knowing is inspiration for writing. Number two, bodies is a mode of multimodal representation. Number three, writing is a way to counter narrate against and with other bodies. And finally, number four, bodies responding to writing. Drawing from Thiel's 2016 work, we frame the findings through the lens that writing is produced in bodies and by bodies in an effort to try and elucidate what people do with bodies. Our implications address writing theory, pedagogy, and research as we argue for greater attention to the multifaceted nature of embodiment and writing, fostering pedagogies that move beyond text-based orientations to acknowledge the relationships between writing, bodies, being, and feeling, and finally, engaging in collaborative analysis procedures with youth over time. Ultimately, we suggest that foregrounding the body can be a means to disrupt the predominant understandings of school writing as limited to the four corners of the page. Mm -hmm.